Hey guys, this is Heather with Urbex Past Masters. Coming to this beautiful day today that God's given us to explore. It's the first time I've did a video here at Maple Hill Cemetery. I have some guests with me, Melanie and Sherry, but they're a little shy right now, so maybe we can catch them in a little bit on camera. So we're in front of this mausoleum that she just told me was supposed to have an angel attached to it that you can see. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to walk around here and look at it for a little bit. So to give you guys a heads up on what I do, I just I walk around and if I see something interesting, I'll stop and look at it and video it and see if I can, you know, if, if I feel something at a certain area, I'll pull my spirit box out and start doing that. Do y'all have any issues with spirit boxes? Yeah. Okay. Um, now that's <coughs> this guy never had an education, but he worked his way up and became president of something. And then... Uh, in the depression it declined and he was losing everything and he shot himself oh wow but see i built this mausoleum i'm not from here so i don't know a lot of the history here let's walk up and see if we can see anything inside i'm a smoker so steps and walking sometimes makes it a little hard <laughs> oh god my husband oh vapes off and on Whew. can you see anything in there Oh, yeah. I don't know if y'all can see anything in there or not. It looks to be several slots. Well, I can see a little bit, but I don't know. That's pretty cool. I definitely want to come out here at night. <laughs> we went to there's a graveyard my husband found that's an old black cemetery that used to be at Huntsville Hospital. Uh -huh. And they moved it when they wanted to build Huntsville Hospital. So we did a night time there. That was pretty cool. I saw someone walk behind a, a headstone there. That would have probably made you run, Melanie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel so good out here. I don't see things as much. I feel really? things. Yeah. 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 I have just, probably in the past six, oh, that is really cool. I have squirrel moments. I'm sorry. I want to go over there and look at that. Y'all see that little, is it a little kid angel or something? Yeah. Let's go look at it. <clears throat> I started picking up on feelings and stuff. And I found out, which I've always been a real sensitive person. Mm -hmm. But in the past year, I've went through a lot of stuff and started getting in tune with my feelings and emotions and stuff. And somebody told me that, they said, did you not know you were an empath? And I was like, what's that? <laughs> you know? Yeah. So, I started feeling stuff. I don't want to walk on that grave. Look at you. That was really pretty. And I go, I work in Athens. And um, I go to a cemetery in Athens that's really old. And uh, yeah, I've got several videos there. And I like the, the ones that are like 1800s and stuff like that. I love that. Newer cemeteries, <laughs> they don't do much for me. No. <clears throat> this is so pretty through here. I wonder if this is family plots. Oh, yeah. It might sound weird, but it seems like you got to have money to be out here. Yeah. Now, let me get a picture of this. This is 1867 to is that 1938 or 28? 1938. Yeah. 1852 to 1915. That's really cool. I like that. I love old ones. And have y'all noticed that in a lot of the older cemeteries that they'll have like a ton of children's graves? Yes. A ton of them. In fact, there's a whole bunch. Like, is it right over here? Just yeah, a bunch be, of kids. Y'all are y'all cool with the camera yet or no? Uh, we you, you can. <laughs> as long as I don't know. If I don't have to talk to it, I'm. Good. No, you're good. Just talk to me if you want. 
But that's what I'm seeing. That we just had Easter. That's why I'm seeing all the Easter lilies. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, there's like in the 1800s, there's like there was a ton of kids dying, a ton of them. And I don't know if there was there some epidemic or something then. Uh, I know the yeah, last flu epidemic, the last large one was 1918. But you know they had TB and pneumonia and. Oh, that, that took a lot of kids out. Yeah. I'm a nurse. Uh, oh, cool. So, okay. I'll just keep up with stuff like that. Yeah. It would be neat if they'd let y'all, uh, if they let people go in the Fulton Center. What's that? Oh, uh, that's in Coleman. Old hospital. hospital. But it, now it's a nursing home. Oh, wow. And I've worked there, and I'm going to tell you, it's a lot. And my daughter worked there. So there's a lot of stuff going on there? Mm -hmm. That is really cool. Like a lot of people walking into walls. I'm gonna go see this mausoleum over here. I really and love mausoleums. Down here with the railing around it. Yeah. You can't read. It's old. You can't read it. Somebody told me on Facebook on one of our posts that there was a mausoleum out here with an old woman buried with her rocking chair. I saw that. Where is that? I don't know. We're hoping you knew. Uh uh. Uh um. I had just read that post. I was like super excited. I was like, where is it at? <laughs> My husband and I, we do a lot of exploring. And um, we find old abandoned houses to go in. I want to do that. We love it. We absolutely love it. <clears throat> the first paranormal experience I had was in an abandoned house in Gunnersville with him. And it was crazy. Oh, wow. That's really cool. That's a marble door, isn't it? Wow. Gee, I have money to be buried out here. <laughs> this is what I call a money cemetery. All right, ladies. Which way y'all want to go? Okay. So, if anybody knows where the mausoleum is with a rocking chair, an old lady. Let us know. Okay, which way? <laughs> this is what kills me. Is it like this is the headstone, yeah, so this is their feet here? Yes. Yeah. So if this is the headstone, that's their feet there, right? No, I don't think anybody's theory right here. Well, these have got to go this way. Oh, yeah. If those are going that way. Well, I know where my dad's, his head is up here and his foot's turned around this way so people can read it, I guess, without but These stepping. are different names. Yeah. They're different names, see? Yeah. So I'm thinking I'm gonna walk through here. Yeah. Because I think this is where That's like their good. feet stop here. Yeah. I get confused like that too. I'm telling you, that drives me crazy. I'm like, oh my I'm god, am I step stepping on, on something? No, I'm gonna step on anybody. Yeah. Oh, well, it They're feels so good. Baby ones too. Yeah. Oh wow. Let's go look at it. Jesse, my husband, is doing some side work today. I don't know how long he's going to be working today, but we came out here yesterday and he took some pictures. Huh? We hadn't really looked at them yet. Wow. That is really old. It looks like an O. This is really cool. Indeed. Like it was born and died on the same day. Oh, wow. I don't know when I thought it said born and died. You can barely see any, yeah. any numbers on them. That was a year old back there. 92 to 93. There was one over there that said born and died and died on the same day. Oh, wow. All right, y'all choose which way no, you want to go. You. I've never been here either. Oh, look at that. Let's go over there. See that huge, whatever it is. Hey, I wonder if this guy knows. <laughs> Stop. I want to ask questions. That's what, when I went to, um, I'm not going to say the name, but one of the cemeteries I go to, the mausoleum I love, that's what what I found somebody out 
work in the area and I asked him about you know what we could do there so he gave me permission to hunt there and to do spirit boxes in the mausoleum and stuff he said we could come back at night but he said we had to be careful because there was a lot of vandalism so there's been a lot of cops patrolling it so I'm kind of a little iffy on that one look at these guys I know that's so cool you know some of these monuments out here it makes me think about who they were yeah mm -hmm. I mean like even the ones that has the big mason monuments and stuff like that yeah. you know well, there's several governors of the state here and like early governors like the first one yeah and um they said President Lincoln's brother-in-law is buried here as well. No way. I was reading about it when we were on our way up. That is cool. Look at all of these. They are so old. This is where you need a pencil and piece of paper. Somebody said wax paper works well. I'm getting the numbers off of it. Miss Melanie's got a better back than me. <laughs> I used to drive a truck for 14 years, so I've got to jack that back. <laughs> I've got grandkids here keeping me a little bit more angry. Oh, God. I just don't see. What? Creepy. Yeah. The way they're just all. Uh huh. You can't see nothing on them. You just don't know who's there, huh? Oh, it's on top. They're all on top. You still can't. Ella F. Nickel is that one. What is it? Ella F. Nickel. Oh, wow. You're good at this. <laughs> you need to come with me all the time. <laughs> and there's old ones across there. And that's what I'm talking about. That's the reach of that. What kills me is. Three roots are going to. Yeah, I don't get why they plant it or plant it. That was right in a tree. Mm hmm. I don't understand why they do that. I bet the tree wasn't there. If it's old enough. Big. Well, that's true. I didn't think about that. Well, they know it's going to grow. Yeah. <laughs> These are all really old. Wow. I love the old ones. The old ones get me. So how are y'all feeling being out here? You feel anything? Uh, I haven't yet. Anything spooking you? Or? Uh, okay, let me know if it does so we can spirit bugs. What I like to think about is these really old ones that are like, like what's the secrets behind them, you know? I like those with like a cloth draped over it. Mm -hmm. Those are really pretty. Wow. So that was just a really big monument. What'd you find? Is that, what does that symbol mean on there? That's a Masonic. Okay, because there was another one over there with it on there. Yeah. I thought it was. But. That's what I'm saying. Some, I mean, my, my dad and my brother was Masonic and my mom was Eastern Star. But, I don't know. They got some really, really dark secrets. <laughs> you know, just don't know, you know? Yeah. So, if you guys see anything or hear anything out here, let us know. Comment down below and put the time on it so we can look it up. Oh, that one's pretty. What did you find, Melanie? Uh, Why was he so prominent to have? Because he's from Maryland. Born in Montgomery County, Maryland, 1804. Died in Lawrence County, Alabama. 25 years and 22 days, or six months. Are, are they all family? Andersons, but this one is a table. And Mary Anderson, Governor 
but I'm assuming they were related. 50 years. It's from Huh. I like when they put items in how, how old they were and stuff. <clears throat> so were they like all buried out to the sides or something? I'm wondering if they're buried. Because there's the... Yeah. Or they just stand them straight up and down underneath it. I mean, you never know. know. <laughs> you never know. Uh, That's pretty. We meet to part no more. See, this is what I'm saying. This has got to be important, rich people. Oh, wow. That is a really old one. I want to find... 21 years. People died so young. They did. They did. But think about how they lived. They didn't... They weren't scared of everything, you know. And I mean, it's, it's like I posted on one of my videos... They 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 had nothing, <laughs> you know, to protect themselves right. but guns or whatever. But as far as medicines, I mean, they just wrote it out, you know. That's a really pretty tree. I want to go. Let's let's go over there to those old ones. I want to do a spirit box over there, maybe. Oh, that's so pretty. Did you that's see great. this one, Melanie? This one with the angel on top. That is pretty. Hey guys, my battery was full on this camera. It's not now. Uh uh. It's not flashing yet, but it's. And my battery never goes low. I mean, I've recorded like 30 plus minutes and it's not gone low before. Thank you. The only other time. I didn't ugly, so that's good. Yeah. The only thing. Look at all those old ones. Yeah. Let's go there. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I've only been told to run twice. It comes like I hear it in my head. It yeah. just says run. Yeah. And once I was at Thunder Cave, I had taken. Might we 